Hello, my Sagittariuses, and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, overcast, cloudy, introverted, chance of some panic today for the archers, the philosophers, the teachers of the zodiac race. The moon is in your opposite sign of Gemini. What that means is your emotions are all tied up on balance issues. So if you're emotional today, it comes down to balance. That balance might be in a relationship. Relationships are the most, uh, those are the most infinite or infamous uh, ways that God Universe has us learn about balance is in relationships. That is the most, you know, uh, powerful, complicated balance. Balance between you and someone else. But this could be simply balance between you haven't gotten enough sleep all week and you're breaking down. But the real breakdown is with beliefs. We're in chapter one of Sun in Leo. This month, the philosophers are going to be upgrading what they believe in. What you believe in is what you love. Now, that's the whole trick to Sagittarius is, by the way. I just downloaded this from God Consciousness right now, actually, is, you know, Santas are always afraid, afraid to say, okay, I know. I know this is it. They're afraid to say, I know. And the reason why you're afraid to say you know is, for one, you don't want the adventure to actually end. You're afraid that if you decide this is the answer, then it's over. By the way, that's an ignorant assumption. Because the truth of the matter is, is if you love what you believe, it's true. That's your power, Sag. And once you say, I know this is true because I love it, I love this idea, it's not that you are discovering truth, it's that you are creating it. And that's what Sagittarius do for us on the planet. They create wisdom. And the, the lessons and the things that become powerful philosophies on Earth are the philosophies you love the most. And you know what? You're correct. If you can get a whole bunch of love behind something you believe, it is correct for now. When is it no longer true? When you no longer love it. Now, there is a square going on. The sun is squaring Jupiter, which means that you might have some fear going on between the life you're trying to create and what you believe. Conflicts between reality and philosophy for the next four days. And if you haven't already checked it out, if you're really stuck, like Cass Boot Camp, this is the most powerful stuff I pulled out of my soul ever. Six solid weeks on Sundays and you're going to turn out in the light. If you don't, you didn't do the work. Check it out, lightcastbootcamp.com. And Skip Jennings, our urban mystic, is live today. He's diving into the love train, and he's going to give and present the first chapter of Love Consciousness, helping you assess where your love is so you can begin to really pump it up and heal it. Skip is live in the garden everywhere we are shining. All right, Sag, that's all I have for today. Good luck to break down, and I'll see you tomorrow with more. Good love be.